video. Quickie video. Baby! Oh, you're so cute. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Come on, baby. She's a little hesitant to the stairs. But I have uh, finished the roof. And it's way sunnier in there now. There's just one little curve here. And uh, should work good. And this is the small door. It's amazing what you can do with uh, some scraps of wood and some duct tape. You can make a beautiful little oasis for your plants in Canada. Yeah, and there's the world's hottest pepper, the ghost pepper. Because regular hot peppers don't cut it for me anymore. Now I've got my own ghost pepper. And the palm's looking beautiful. This palm is such a sturdy little thing. And I got the fan there to blow everything around. And look at how much room I have on the loft now. You see where the old peak used to go? Well, this was the peak used to go down to here. And then it went up. And this was a part of the old peak here. That was the first uh, greenhouse right there. And then I added on last year that peak and now I just instead of having the twin peaks added that uh, layer there so I have a lot more room on the old side this is the old side of the greenhouse the original side that I've been I rebuild it a little bit here and there a little bit at a time and just fix things and tear them apart as I need to and it's such a cute little place honestly like everything is growing so wonderfully. My succulents look radiant. Look at how the sun comes in in the west and makes them look fluorescent. There's even enough sun to make this little guy go. Isn't that cute? And I love that succulent. I only have the one. I'll have to make more of that. It's such an amazing little succulent. Yeah, I like my succulents. So now I can fit that big... Uh, uh, succulent planter on that shelf there and look at how beautifully the sun's coming in and I even have a shelf over there with a cow where's the cow there's the cow I got a cow holy cow there's a cow up on the roof uh, I just made that shelf just so I could put extra stuff because the fairies are taking everything up that's why the fairies are taking up all the space. All these little shelves here are for the fairy stuff. Because fairies come first around here. Look at that little planter there. There's fairies everywhere. And fairy ponds. The fairies are sleeping. And guppies are swimming. There's a bunch of little guppy babies over there in that little guppy pond in the guppy village in the guppy fairy village in the fairy greenhouse look at how cute that's new right there that little um, beautiful little dried arrangement the flowers even feel like they're real like I found this at the second hand store and it's just a beautiful little piece and it looks so fun and colorful right there with the succulents and, and the dragonfly and my beautiful money tree and fairies are everywhere. I have to fix that fairy house. It was outside for the summer. And the little fairy pond. Like I haven't got enough going on. There's a little tank here with all the guppies. The hornwort's kind of taking over. I'll have to fix that and thin some of the hornwort out perhaps. And that is a glorious beautiful day in my greenhouse with the world's hottest pepper, the ghost pepper there. Because regular peppers aren't hot enough anymore. And I love those windows a friend gave it, uh, them to me and I'm so thankful <coughs> I got them last year I think and I put them in 